Alex Nelson here with Brothers by Nature. Michael Schreiber, what's up? Let's do this. Hello, YouTube. This is gonna be our uh, first YouTube video. It's gonna fuck. And uh, that's fine, because we're gonna get better at it. And you guys are gonna see this grassroots sh video. And then you're gonna see the awesomeness. Not right, Alex. The awesomeness. drainage and just some extra style nice little flagstone walkway all the way to the grass to the wood stamp concrete this stuff sells like crazy out here in Colorado very popular right now flagstones go to that patio built this wall here to raise up for the patio here so they can have some barbecuing area some trash space this wall here on the other side was what the builder did so we couldn't finish this whole fence all the way up or it would have just been the same size as the uh, retaining wall there so we decided to do a railing which is part of why this job took so long to complete because we ordered it from Home Depot and they canceled it without 
telling us twice, so that wasted about a month's worth of time. Put it around the top part of the patio here, make sure nobody falls off. A few little things that we're gonna be doing is putting the chicken wire down on the bottom there, make sure the dog doesn't get out, and we're gonna build a little gated area for the trash cans. But everything else, really cool. We matched up the stairs here to go with the concrete path. We did it with flagstone. Had to build them in with the same retaining brick. But overall, I think this project turned out really good. I wish we could get an aerial view, but Alex has to fix the uh, drone he bought. So that's this one. That's a wrap for it. All right, so we just left the last project, uh, doing a little walkthrough for everybody. Hopefully it turns out really well. This is gonna be the first YouTube video that I will be editing for this channel. Um, hopefully many more to come. Not 100% sure where we wanna go with the channel. I know we definitely want to show um, progress for jobs. I know we want to do like how-to videos for some people. Uh, we do wanna use it as a platform to gain clients too, so I think some of the time-lapse stuff will be really good for that. Um, we also want to answer questions from homeowners to try and, you know, come up with different ways that can help them to do stuff on their own or hiring a contractor in general. Um, we can't really speak for too many other states, but, you know, we can kind of try and give an idea for how much we're charging for everything so that you know people can feel comfortable hiring a contractor uh, making sure that they're getting the best bang for their buck and then also you know just I guess we kind of have an idea too to do some sort of almost like a podcast type deal of our business adventure of what we're going through what we're learning and that's basically it. Um, so hopefully, you know, this this can reach a lot of uh, people. I don't imagine our first video will reach a whole lot of people, but for those of you that do see this, please, you know, give it a like, um, subscribe to our channel, and comment with any questions or stuff that you guys would like to see on the channel. And, uh, you know, we'll work and do our best to deliver. I don't know how quickly we're gonna get a lot of this stuff out. Because there's really just a couple of us doing the work of many as far as the operation side goes um, so finding the time to be able to edit these videos and everything we'll figure it out but uh, a couple lessons maybe I guess for the job that we just left uh, we kind of spoke about I'm saying uh, a lot and it's getting embarrassing and hopefully my air conditioner isn't too loud it's about 100 degrees today uh, towards the end of the July here out in Colorado but we spoke with Alex a little bit about you know lessons that we learned on this job it was actually the biggest landscaping job we've done yet to date and it was uh, all said and done like right around 37,000 uh, with a few other little things that we're gonna be doing here at the end Jesus this is the longest I've waited to turn left ever um, but let's see so we did not charge enough for the railing we'd never done it before but it was a solution that we spoke of I went over a little bit with that retaining wall that was already in there uh, the builders did that retaining wall and just setting our pen fence posts right next to it would have been dumb we had to run an irrigation line right next to it so we ended up uh, coming up with the idea to put a railing on top of the retaining wall that could also match to keep a railing because that patio, that top patio there is, is raised about almost five feet um, 
so and they have um, they actually have a kid with special needs so obviously we need to make sure that everything's safe for everybody and I think we only charged $35 a foot for that railing and we should have been somewhere in the 40s um, we just kind of finished everything out so I'll be able to map out the money side of everything on that and get a better going rate for that as we move forward because I think that that's obviously something that we want to be able to have in our repertoire to sell the other clients it's something that can really spice up a yard or a deck or whatever you're doing so uh, the other things honestly that's really the only thing that went not according to plan on that job our concrete guy did pour a little bit more than we were expecting but it all worked out because uh, they got a really nice size patio there right behind the house where the hot tub is and hopefully in the future we're gonna be going back and building some sort of like pergola shade over it or like a shade to the side of it to kind of block the neighbors from being able to you know see them right when they're trying to enjoy their hot tub time and hopefully get the neighbor's house and uh, keep moving on so yeah like I said let us know you know what you guys would like to see from us if you're watching this or if you have any questions we're gonna try and do some videos on how we're running stuff on the business side how we're building certain things what we're charging basically everything you need to know about running a landscaping and landscaping and fencing company and just a bit a business in general you know there's I mean none of us have done any sort of business type stuff really um, in the past so we are learning just by going for it uh, which we're finding out is basically how everybody else in the world has done it so we're getting our asses handed to us 99% of the time but we're learning and it's awesome and this is our next step of the journey is to create this channel and hopefully bring some value to uh, other contractors people that are wanting to start a business and those of you in the Colorado area that are looking to get your landscaping or fencing done and want it done by some quality professionals. So anyways, again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again for tuning in. Peace.